Come on. This might be amusing. Yo, what is up guys, X-Edge here and we are back again with another video and this time we are delving around on a game called Mega Knockdown. Now, this is something that I um, happened to follow on Twitter. So, there was a post from the um, creator of this game and they were just talking about if people wanted a base from this, you know, just leave a like or a comment or something like that did that it sent me a product key and yeah so that's how i got my hands on it and um yeah we're just gonna see what it is about today um it did look kind of strange i'm not gonna lie when i first saw it i um, in terms of the presentation it kind of goes back to um oh i'm trying to think of one of those games now um the only one i could think of that really does it is mortal kombat like the old ones with a you know video captured real humans put them into the game and did all that kind of weird stuff. I don't know how to explain it. But um, that's what's on this game. And yeah, now we're just gonna try it out. And as usual, without learning anything about it, we're just gonna actually, no, should we go to the tutorial if there's anything on it? Oh, wow, okay. Okay, there is a lot of stuff that I need to know about. And as you can see, there's a turn system. So can't just go in there and just be fighting all that. Knock down to advantage of press up, punishing, blocking, and get the advantage back. Different types of throws, using advantage for setups, air throws, special attacks, and ship damage. Um, for the sake of this video, I don't want to like delve into the lessons just yet. I think I will do that um, after. Actually, do you know what? Let's learn this thing together. Let's do that. So let's let's just get into the tutorial and take it from there. I'm a little bit indecisive. Usually I just jump into arcade, but let's see what's about. All right, lesson select, turn system. Let's go. As usual, playing on a PS4 controller, everything seems to be fine. Uh, this is a turn-based game. Each turn, both players lock in a movement action and a combat action, and then these players will play out. Uh, these actions will play out rather. Player's choices are visible at the bottom of the screen. All right, so select movement action. So I suppose that's, you know, left, right, up, down. So I'll go down. Uh, combat action, square. Nice. Okay. The actual pause if either player is not locked in. In some lessons, one of your inputs will be chosen for you. Okay. Walking moves. Uh, okay. Standing still skips your movement. Jumping lets you move up two spaces. Okay, walk forward. Backward. Stand still. Okay, so you don't duck, you just stand still. And then jump backwards. Nice. Okay. Jumping backward is possible with jump and block. Otherwise, you will jump forward. Right, so I guess back is block. There are three basic ground attacks. A is fast jab, short range. B is slower, medium ranged poke. And C is a slow sweep that knocks down. C can't hit to jump an opponent. So attack with A, okay, that's square. B is B triangle. Oh gosh, I don't know what I just did. Okay, that's C. A square. Nice. Okay. I need to get used to it. So, A is square, B is X, and C is circle. Attacks can beat each other out through superior range or speed. Okay. Blocking prevents damage from attacks. You can put uh, and can put you an advantage next turn. Block. Okay. Whoops. <laughs> what? 
Okay. Okay, I need to find out what the block button is. Okay. Nice. L1 to block. And R1 is to grab. Next. Am I going to go through all these lessons right now? Throws are unblockable, short range moves, ground throws, can't hit a jumping opponent. Two throws cancel each other out into a tech throw. Okay. Nice. Okay, yeah. Throws are a neutral counter to a blocking opponent. Neutral plus a throw also beats ground attacks. Okay. Uh, done. Let's keep going. For the sake of not being indecisive, let's just kind of stick with this thing. Do a quick run on arcade and then we'll call it a day with that one. So, there are three basic jumping attacks. Jumping A is an air to air jab. Jumping B is a medium attack drop kick. And jumping C is a spinning punch that knocks down and can side switch. Okay, that's jumping A. What the heck? <laughs> Oh, that jumping C is funny. Jumping attacks are slow compared to ground attacks, but they send you forward rapidly and convey certain moves. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay. If two attacks at the same time, they will trade, causing both players to be hit. Okay, trade again. Nice. Okay, okay. Neither player gets a combo during a trade. Okay, so they've got combos on this game. I'm intrigued to see what it's like. Faster attacks interrupt slow attacks. If both would hit A and B attacks, start a combo and hit. Interrupt, jump in A. Oh, okay. Nice. Interesting, okay. Combo triggers, uh, sorry, combos trigger automatically and are your reward for a clean hit with A or B. So when I did that, it was literally just A on its own. It did that three-hit combo on both A and B. Uh, standing still by pressing down makes your attack come out faster than if you moved. Use this to fight off the advancing enemy. So the approach standing B. See, three-hit combo. There you go. Nice. Okay. Blocking and long-range moves can disrupt a player spamming standing pokes. Okay. If an attack is out of range after the movement step, it whiffs. You use backward movement and longer reaching attacks to counter the opponent's jabs. Uh, okay. Hmm. Okay. I just. Oh well. Alright, move in and hit again. Nice. Crap, I forgot to turn on the Discord notification, so if this video keeps getting blub blub blub, that's going to be very annoying. Anyway, moving forward and attacking is risky, but it can keep you in range of a retreating opponent. Yep, okay. Alright, stages have finite um, boundaries or corners. If you are the corner, your backward movement is restricted. Corner. This cautions opponents by advancing at them on the ground. Ooh, excuse me. Walk the opponent into the corner. Walk them into the corner. Nice. Okay. I don't think you can move without going for an attack. Knockdown opponents, uh, players cannot move horizontally and their attacks are delayed. Knock down the opponent and attack them as they're getting up. Okay, knock down the opponent with C. Attack them all, wake up. Ah. Uh, okay, so knock down with C. And I uh, try and go forward and do. Okay. Oh my gosh. Knock down with C. Maybe not. <laughs> okay, okay. Really?
Really? Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> if I'm gonna get stuck on this, I'm gonna move on to the next one. Hmm. Can I just attack naturally? Nice. Okay, I'll take it. So just a trade. You still can input movement while knocked down, including jump, but your horizontal movement is cancelled. Okay. If a plus attack such as A is blocked, the defender's attacks next turn are delayed. Use repeated A's to pressure the blocking opponent. Nice. Okay. Blocking unsafe attacks such as C lets you counter attack with a punish of your choice. Block this opponent's attack and punish them. Okay. Come at me, bro. Wait, how do you block the sweep? There we go. Nice. Yeah. Alright, cool. Hmm. Hand based fires are a bit. Like, I wouldn't say difficult for me to understand, but I'm just a bit like, meh. I feel like I'd rather play like a JRPG or something like that instead, but you know what? Let's just delve into it anyway. This is still the alpha, things are subject to change. But uh, yeah, if you block a minus attack or if the opponent whiffs their attacks next turn are delayed, uh, use blocking to gain the upper hand offensively. Okay, block B. Interrupt. Oh, okay, moving up. Okay. Um, I'm so confused right now. Yeah, I'm really confused. Hmm. Nope. Can I jump instead? Nope. Okay, I'm seriously confused. <laughs> okay, I blocked it the first time. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get it. Okay, I'll try one more time just for the sake of saying that I tried. Okay. So. Block the B, yeah, and somehow I messed up there. Yeah, if it's if it's something I'm not getting, then oh well. And it's like as soon as I mess this whole thing up, it's kind of hard for me to do anything else. Nah, I don't get it. <laughs> where was I? Oh, it didn't even tell me where I was. I think I was maybe there. Okay, yeah, 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 I was here. Blocking to get advantage, different types of throws, using advantage to set up throws, air throws, special attacks, and chip damage. Okay, and I'm definitely gonna be giving it feedback as soon as I do this. But yeah, just delving into it, let's just throw ourselves into arcade with whatever we've learned, if we have learned anything, and see where it goes from there. So we got arcade mode, survival versus computer, and the pool zone. You are about to enter the pool zone. For your own safety, please turn back. Okay, what the heck is that? <laughs> Alpha version, no story content yet, but can I still pick it? Aha. Oh, okay, so we've got different characters. So, Shotokan artist Paul. Dr. Flatskin. Oh my freaking gosh. <laughs> Nick Beard Guy. Mahogany <laughs> Marv. M.M. Lewis and Big Billy. So it's the same character just doing different poses. Interesting. <laughs> uh, the character portraits are very misleading. Alright, Mr. Nick Beard Guy. 
let's see how it goes with you. Okay, so it doesn't start until I make a move. Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay, we're back. Oh, okay. Interesting. Uh, let's go for the jump and that. <laughs> that move is so funny. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh. Okay. How is he doing that? What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go back. Okay, uh, shall I move forward? Uh, jump, go for the attack. Nice. He's down on the floor, kick him. Oh, okay. Okay, screw it. Oh, okay, we both tried to grab. Nope. Needs to get up. Nice. Jump and spin. Was that a trade? Yes, it was, and I got the win. I look around. Okay, final round. Jump and spin again. Jump and spin again. Oh, okay. No, no. Move forward. Okay. Uh, sweep. Sweep again. Oh my gosh, you got me. Okay. Sweep again. Sweep. Oh, wait. Side switch? Oh, crap. I'm. Okay, now I'm so confused. Yeah, it was a side switch. Oh, crap. Nope. One more. Oh, crap, you blocked it. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, what the heck? Okay, let's go for a rematch. Okay. Jump. Nice. Sweep. Jump. Slide out. Switch side. Sweep. Sweep again. Oh. Move forward. Move forward. Quick jab. Nice. That'll do. Okay, I'm going to get in the hang of it. I uh, only see how throws work. So let's try forward and then throw. Oh, that does damage. Sweep. Jump. Yes. Okay. Every time I do that move, it um, puts me onto the other side. Oh. Wait, oh, stage two, okay, cool. Um, yeah, let's go. Crap, uh, move back. Wait, oh, you don't wanna put yourself in the corner, jump. Oh, what? Okay, jump again. For flip sake, okay, sweet. Oh, he blocked it. Oh, what the heck was that? Okay, jump, helicopter, nope, didn't work. Um, Forward sweep. That didn't work. Let's go for forward B. Didn't work. Jumping C. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Uh, forward grab. Forward grab again. Nope, that didn't work because he was recovering. Forward grab. Nope, went for the sweep. Forward. Nope, nope, forward A, forward A, jumping C, oh my gosh, jumping C, <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, jumping C, jumping C, jumping C, nope, well, okay, I don't know why I did that, grab, forward grab, nope, he's going back, um, Back and sweep. Jump. Jump C. Switch sides. Uh, sweep. Sweep again. Oh, he's blocked it. Oh, crap. Nice. Okay. Final round. Uh, this is fourth round. Nope. Back a bit. I'm gonna go back and sweep. Forward sweep. Oh crap. I think it's easier for me to kind of compute the things as I'm saying it, because if I can't just jump and start pressing random buttons, because then it'll be harder for me to compute whatever I'm doing right now. Okay. Get up, sweep. Oh crap. Nope. Jump C. Oh my gosh. Jump C. 
Jump C. Ford grab. Oh my gosh. Oh, all right. I'll do this one more time. If I lose, I'll leave it as that. Um, and then if not, I'll continue. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. Fourth throw. Don't work. I need to block as well. Uh, four block. Oh my gosh. Jump. <laughs> Sweet. Oh, you blocked it. Oh my gosh. See what I mean? When I don't say anything and a match kind of goes on, I lose track of what I'm doing. Uh, forward block. Grab. Forward grab. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um, jump circle. Jump circle. Oh my gosh. Okay, no, I've, I've lost the plot. I've lost the plot. All right, I'll leave us that for now. I'll leave us that for now. But yeah, guys, that was a mega knockdown. Uh, if you do want to try it out for yourself, I'm not entirely sure if you can still get your hands on this beta, but of course what I will do is at least leave a link to the description of the Twitter of this. So if you want to ask more questions, know more about the game, um, yeah, I'm going to pop the link in the description for that. My thoughts on the game, um, for a turn-based fighter, this isn't something I'm used to, other than in RPGs and stuff like that. But um, yeah, it was interesting in a kind of a weird way. It, it kind of took a little bit of time for me to understand what was going on. And again, it felt like I had to, you know, speak what I was doing to really understand what I was doing, if that makes sense. Whereas, you know, with fighting games, everything is all in your head. I needed to just say what I was doing to understand what was going on. It's, it's kind of weird to understand. Play it for yourselves and let me know where it goes from there. But yeah, I'm not going to say too much on this, but it's very interesting. Very, very, it's an interesting one. I'll be intrigued to see what happens if they add more characters, you know, things like that. This is just the alpha, so hopefully there's a lot more to come. Uh, wish the game development and the people behind the game all the success in the world. And yeah, feel free to follow me on Twitter. And as always, good games and peace out.